Hello, this is Broyer, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for Farming Simulator 22 as we continue our Swiss chocolate run here. And we're about ready to fast forward to the month of August. I left my tractor over here because we're going to pick up a little bit more chocolate before we move away from here. So we'll go ahead and get the fast forwarding done. And go from there. August will be uh, fertilizing the grass, I guess, is the only thing we probably have to do. Maybe take care of the cows a little bit. Uh, do I have any... I still have a little bit of equipment that we're borrowing, although we're going to get rid of this pretty soon here. So, all should be good there. Um, I mean, there's a planter. Would be nice to have a decent planter, although we don't have it. There's no... Uh, I don't know if there's, it does hold a thousand liters of seed. I guess the seed goes inside the little hoppers above each, uh, each row, I guess. Um, this one does not cultivate, though, so... Be nice to have another little tractor. I don't know. I think we're fine for now. Um, nothing super urgent. Uh, let me go ahead and... Uh, I'm going to leave you here because I think, if anything, we'll be picking up stuff here again before we go anywhere else. Some uh, sorghum ready to harvest. All right, let's grab our fertilizer. Get that rolling. Thankfully, the grass won't need much, so should go. Well, I won't go quickly because it still goes the same speed, but it will not use much of our fertilizer stockpile. But honestly, I wouldn't even care to fertilize the grass at all. Like, I don't... A little bit of fertilizer missing, I don't think is going to matter that much on the overall yield. Um, but it does penalize us for the selling of the products. So, still need to do it, unfortunately. Uh, here's what it is. Um, let's come over here and check the cows got a little bit of milk, milk back again we got some slurry um which we're not really gonna do anything with uh we're good on tmr still for now next set of cows will be eight months yes yeah, eight months for both of those um so yeah we'll see i mean we're not gonna get those that reproduction though right so we are in fact we're actually gonna wait until the second oldest cows are old enough to reproduce, which would be these that aren't even old enough to, they're not even old enough to start reproducing yet. These Once these get close, these will be the ones that we reproduce and then can keep. We're gonna keep these until they hit 36 months old. So that's another 16 months and then we'll sell them. Um, we're gonna lose a round of reproduction, but that's okay. So not going to be a problem with that at all. Uh, really, there's not much else for us to do this month. It's really just knock out this fertilizing real quick and then move on with our day. I mean, I don't think there's any contracts that we care about. Definitely don't care about the sorghum, the canola, potatoes, no. Sorghum, sorghum, nope. Don't care about any of that.
All right, I think one thing I'm gonna do, is I, I don't know why I haven't done this before now. I'm gonna finally, I think, uh, where is it? Landscaping, I went to the wrong thing. We're gonna finally clean up some of the, uh, some of the visuals here, which again, I should have done this a long time ago, but eh, whatever. Well, it's not gonna be super easy because of the sizes we've got going on here. Uh, and that might dip into the field a little bit. Just... One thing I wish that was in this game was a way to uh, grid snap this type of stuff. That would make my life so much easier. And I've looked, and, there, and I've looked for mods. If you know of one, let me know, but I could not find one. I could find grid snapping for placing buildings and placeables and things like that, but not grid snapping for painting. So, probably going to dip into the field a little bit on a couple of these, but I don't think it's going to be that big of a deal. Is this the most important thing for us to spend money on? Of course it is. So, <laughs> that's why we're doing it. Uh oh, went over a little bit on that one. Let's see if I can repaint that here in a moment. Doesn't help with the the planting does not go where you actually have the cur the the outline. I like that it exists. I don't like how it works. Definitely think they could. I mean, how hard would it be to put grid snapping on this? Come on, seriously. I mean, sure, we, a lot of times you might turn it off, but at least make it an option. Honestly, I might leave the little overhang. It makes it look more like a... Honestly, it's actually kind of fine. I'm kind of okay with it. I don't think you would have perfectly straight lines normally. So, yeah, we'll leave it. All right, all right. I'm coming back to you, buddy. If I can do it better with the mouse. A little bit, little bit better fine tuning, although it's still, again, because it's not exactly where the square says it is, it's still not perfect.
I mean, we've spent 15,000 bucks just doing this, but you know, it's important because it's so boring looking otherwise. That's not to be careful of because of the the road. Um, we might come back to well, let's see if I just change the shape. Let's go right up to the fence. I think we'll be all right. Yeah, something like that. Looks all right. Definitely better than it was, I think. Of course, I'm not gonna figure out how I'm gonna do this over here. I guess I keep kind of the circular shape for now. Again, I don't think it has to be perfect, so. All my money. I have to borrow money just to do this. <laughs> Because this is important. Oh, I was like, why are you got... Because I ran out of money. All right, let's see if we can get this little bit here. Um... Uh, almost. That's actual grass there. We probably want to cover that up. No, I got into the field.
<laughs> I don't know why I've spent so much time doing this. It's just it's bothered me for so long. Mm. Oh, I gotta borrow more money. I've spent what forty, fifty thousand bucks on this right now already. Why are we still able to do it with no money? I'm confused. Wait, so if you go all the way down to nothing, then you don't actually... <laughs> That's very confusing. Alrighty. Looks a little bit more not dumb, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Uh, a little bit more just natural, like it's just out there, right? So, uh, let me lower this down and just get this a little bit back here. Cool. I think I'm pretty happy with that. All right. I guess I should borrow... Well, I guess I don't need to borrow money right this second, because I'm just going to do the rest of this manually. Apologies. Apologies if that was boring, but uh, like I said, it's been bothering me. So, I got to bring you guys along for the ride. And I'm not going to overstress the imperfections, so. Normally I would, but I'm like, whatever now, <laughs> to be honest. It's all going to be fine. That's just a little bit over here, and then we're done. Nice. Not too bad. Uh, I think the cat, I've already checked the cows right. They're already good to go. Other than being too full on slurry, they have plenty of straw. They got enough food. So we should be fine there. I guess I'll double check the outputs one more time and then we're good to fast forward. Chocolate's good, butter or cheese is good, so let's go. We'll split us in September, which would be butter selling month. I uh, get if we had butter, maybe someday. I do need to put some more milk in the chocolate if I remember correctly this month, right? Yeah, it doesn't have, it does not have enough for the month. Uh, we do need to come to the cheese here momentarily. Uh, what else we got? Um, nothing here that we care about. How are the cows? Definitely need some food and some straw. So we'll get that taken care of momentarily as well. Let's start with some mowing now. I think we'll mow two more times before I worry about gathering any of this up. Yes, yes.
How much money did we spend on landscaping last month? 71,000 bucks. All right, that's fine. I'm still very happy with it because it was bothering me. Every time I come into this save, I'm like, man, why does this one look so... <laughs> it looks so silly looking. I wish the grass that you planted down was the same it was in 19 where it turned into metal grass. Like it was still growable grass. It's a little annoying that it's two separate entities now. And I really need another small tractor. I mean, at 19 horsepower, there's no way this thing is able to pull anything. <laughs> uh, it's interesting, though, I guess. Carry like two pallets around. Maybe one. Yeah, I mean, I don't know, even know what you would do with this thing. There's not much this thing will be useful for with such small horsepower. This mower more powerful than our tractor can actually handle? 160? No. Does it just always go 17 miles an hour? I feel like it used to go faster. No, it should go 13 miles an hour. Why is it going so slow? I assume the tractor was low on on um, maintenance, but maybe it's the mower and that's why it's going slow. Because that, that low on the tractor should not be... If that was just the tractor, then it would not be dipping that low. But if it's the tractor is a little bit higher, but the mower is basically completely, you know, dead, then the average will show up as a little bit lower, and uh, that would explain why the mower is going so slow. I guess we'll just get everything repaired up real quick, and then go on about our business. Hmm, it wasn't that damaged. Maybe that front bit was, because it's actually not worth that much. So 282 bucks on that front bit is actually probably quite a bit. There you go. Now it's building up a bit more speed. That's better. A little bit of a slow build up, but it's still faster. So that's going to make it go way quicker. All right, we're going to let this run between episodes. Um, when we come back, I'll probably have the mowing done, and then we'll take care of the rest of the things that we got to do today. But I do appreciate you guys watching. May God bless you, and I hope you join me again next time. Thank you, and goodbye. I wanted to give a special shout-out to the following channel members. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.